Echelon got a positive ID on your target from the morgue security cameras. A guy named Vyacheslav Vinko. How do I find him? By his license plate. And if he's not with his car? Then his driver will be. Grab him and make him talk. Don't be afraid to use force. Who? Me? Grim's daughter just pulled up the schematics on the Ministry. They've got a laser security grid online in the courtyard. So I stay out of the courtyard. Don't let them trigger any alarms at all. We still don't have any official approval from the Joint Chiefs for this operation. So one slip up and it's mission over. God, who are you? I'm going to ask you some questions, when I think you're lying, 
I'll do this. I... Who do you work for? Vyacheslav Grinko. Tell me about him. He used to be Spetsnaz. Now he's mercenary. He works for President Nikolas. Where do I find Grinko? He is meeting Mass in the elevator by the courtyard. Who's Mass? Philippe Mass, some computer guy. He has access to Nikolas's office. What's this meeting about? I don't know. I swear, it's gotta be something bad if Nikolas is willing to see Grinko face to face. I need you to understand that we never talked. I understand. Good. I want to hear what Gringo and Mass talk about in that elevator. I'll need to deactivate the courtyard laser grid to get in position. Then do it. Come on out where I can see you. I need a colonel down here. We're trying to get through a retinal scanner. I passed Colonel Kibiashvili on my patrol. Want me to send him down? God, no. I hate this guy. We'll find somebody else with the lamp. <laughs>
I passed Colonel Kibiashvili on my patrol. Want me to send him down? God, no. I hate this guy. We'll find somebody else with the land. I thought the kitchen was closed. It's a special order for Colonel Kabayashvili. Ah, excellent. <laughs> May I? Please. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Kind of Unidentified. something new. Oh!
got an incoming colonel, Fisher. Make the most of him. You'll need him conscious and cooperative if you want to... You've got an incoming colonel, Fisher. Make the most of him. You'll need him conscious and cooperative if you want to unlock the retinal scanner sealing the door to the courtyard. That's detailed intelligence. Knowing everything is my job. got an incoming colonel, Fisher. Make the most of him. You'll need him conscious and cooperative if you want to unlock the retinal scanner sealing the door to the courtyard. That's detailed intelligence. Knowing everything is my job. Who's best? Oh. I heard something move. That's one alarm to The glass elevator's in motion. Make with the laser, Mike Fisher. It's mission critical that we hear what Grinko and Mass say before they reach the top. Savages. Why did you rip it out with pliers? We had some difficulty with Blostein's ship. You can see fibers of muscle tissue still attached. Nasty. 
Nasty. You're in the wrong line of work to avoid getting gore on your hands. Whatever Nico adds does in Azerbaijan is his own conscience's burden. You are just a tool? You're it. I'm the technology. I'm the cleanup man. All the blood's on yours and Nikolaj's hands. I'm clean. And it is? It's what? Clean. Azerbaijan? Yeah, man. The operation's goddamn immaculate. Except for the files Nikolaj insists on keeping on his own machine. You need to talk to that. Sounds like we found the subdermals. I get nervous when the bad guys start making blood jokes. That conversation's going straight to the Joint Chiefs. And we're gonna need more. Nikolaj's computer. You guessed it. Get inside his office and access that machine. Alarms aren't mission critical anymore. We're moving into Fifth Freedom territory. Who's there? Who's there? That's not good. Heard something.
What is that? Enemy troops! Out of the wood! Enemy troops! What is that? Intruder! I'm under fire! Christ almighty. What do you have? Bad things. 
Keep transmitting. We need to see how far this goes. What's going on? Corpses, refugee camps. They've had commandos at work in Azerbaijan for weeks. How the hell did we miss this? Keep transmitting. Alert! All men to full alert! We have an intruder in Nikolaj's office! Wake up, you bastard! I want troops in there now! Trinko, sir. I've got three men about to breach Nikolaj's office. from Nikolaj's computer. This stuff is going straight to the president. He might be headed for military action and we're going to need airtight proof. That's the end of it. Thank God. What exactly is going on? You wouldn't believe the numbers. Nikolaj has been systematically murdering his way through Azerbaijan. And we didn't know about it. Nobody did. What does he want? You can watch the news later. Rendezvous with Junior Wilkes for extraction. This office is clear. We're heading for the rear gangway. Where are you? I heard something. Intruder! Nicolas, this office is clear. We're heading for the rear gangway. Come out! I want an update. Why hasn't the intruder been caught yet? Do we have men on the real stairwell? About to breach the stairwell, sir. What the hell did you find in there, man? Lambert's flipping out big time. What's he saying? That we're going to war. Georgian special forces have taken hold of villages scattered throughout Azerbaijan. Incredibly, Kambayn Nogolads appears to have been able to move thousands of troops across the border over a course of weeks, completely hidden from both local and international authorities through a high-tech... Number of Azerbaijani casualties are unknown, but early estimates number in the high... The freedom-loving people of the world cannot stand idly by and allow an act of such staggering inhumanity and scale. In their third day of fighting, U.S.-led NATO troops took three more Azerbaijani villages occupied by Georgian special forces. U.S. troops met only light resistance and suffered minimal casualties. 
The Georgian commando cells are becoming increasingly hard to locate as military intelligence suffers repeated... Combain Nicolades has vanished, along with his top military advisors. Speculation points to Nicolades' fear of a war crimes tribunal as motivation... A two-minute webcast from locations unknown, Georgian President Combain Nicolades called America and its allies an army of scarecrows, declaring them helpless to defend themselves or their homeland. The precise nature of Nicolaza's threat, experts fear, could make itself known within 